Things began to unravel Monday morning at the APC Secretariat. The president had just purportedly asked the governor of Yobe State, who doubles as the chairman of the APC Convention Committee, to step aside and his place, the governor of Niger State, Abubakar Sani Sanibelo, was asked to step in. The new chairman was to oversee a meeting of the Convention Committee at the APC Secretariat Monday. By the time a rise news crew got to the Secretariat, the police had cordoned off both ends of the Blantyre Street where the APC Secretariat is located. When it looked like the meeting was not going to hold, Sani Bello drove in and went straight upstairs for an emergency meeting with the Convention Committee, which had the Secretary, Senator John Atman Udoedea, in attendance. The Senator had earlier said Bello does not have the local standi to call any meeting and that the sacking of the Convention Committee was fake news. After the emergency meeting, Bello came downstairs to administer the oath of allegiance and oath of office to the elected chairman of the various states. You recall that some time back you were inaugurated, you were issued your certificate of return, and today we're here so that you take your oath of office and allegiance so that you can perform your functions and duties. This was what some of the chairmen said after taking their oath of office and allegiance. My major assignment is as soon as I go back to River State, I'm going to governize agreed members of the party to make sure they come back for us to work like a fact, based on the directive the governor of Niger State gave to us today. Politics, we all know, is something that touches on lives. And we are determined to get back to Anambra State right. and ensure that we turn the state fully to APC this time around. Yeah. Abia is ripe for APC. And so my, my role will be for those who have been sitting on the fence for them to come back home. And I was swearing in today, sign posts that there's a new executive at the second level, at the tertiary, second tier level. So therefore, it's uh, anybody who is uh, canvassing that idea is not true. APC is going to be stronger after this convention. At the end of the meeting, some APC governors, the Deputy Senate President and the Secretary to the Federal Government of the Federation, drove in for a meeting that apparently had been scheduled earlier. The governors did not brief the press, but the chairman of the convention committee did. When Arise News asked him what his position is now, this was what he had to say. Acting Chairman of APC and Governor of Niger State, Caretaker Committee, yes. Acting Chairman, Caretaker Committee. Okay, so to the question, what's the position of my Malabuni, he replied. I'm not aware of any position at the moment. I know, I know he has traveled. Sorry? I know he has traveled. Before my Malabuni sacking, some stakeholders of the party, along with some former and sitting governors and senators, have been pushing for his removal from office. They alleged that Buni and the members of the committee were planning to force on the party a consensus candidate for the chairmanship position, as well as presidential candidate of their choice. As at the time of this report, the man in the eye of the storm, Yobe State Governor, Mai Malabuni, was out of the country for medical reasons. The APC convention is scheduled to take place on the 26th of March, while the Zono Congresses will hold in the midst of the convention. Indeed, Amungo, Arise News.